Mumbai's collection of Art Deco buildings is amongst the largest in the world. But how did Art Deco come to Bombay? It all started when Europe began to buy cotton from India after its western market was ruined by the American Civil War. An excellent port, Bombay became the trade center to bring in cotton from different parts of India and export it to Europe. As other trades followed cotton in the years to come, Indian merchants became affluent. They began traveling for work and leisure to Europe and came across architecture belonging to a new design movement. Known as style modern and later as art deco, it combined existing architectural elements with those from different cultures. It caught the attention of the world at the exhibition of modern industrial and decorative arts that was held in Paris. Some of the French pavilions that housed the exhibits were built by fusing the European architectural elements with exotic art and design. Inspired by the industrial marvels of the age, Deco soon imbibed their features such as curvilinear forms and streamlining and ushered a new future in design. Deco appealed to the wealthy natives of Bombay as an aspirational style. It moved away from Gothic and Indo-Saracenic, letting them embrace modernism. As the need for housing grew in Bombay, it was Art Deco that flourished. On land that was created under the Back Bay Reclamation Scheme, came up a promenade of Deco buildings, first around Oval Medan and then around Marine Drive, followed by Baikala, Mohammad Ali Road, Dadar, and Matunga.